Mogul stands on a rise, not a very commanding rise, and unlike a castle, this simple auberge does not intimidate. The building's ground floor is occupied by the Topsail Breeze Tavern. Mogul can be entered at the far side. Just look for a round, red 1950s Coca-Cola sign over the door. After a short stair climb, a narrow corridor will lead you to a dining room that seats about 30 people. We began with poppadums and chutney. The warm pebbled surface and brown edges indicated that our poppadums had been freshly toasted. Flecked with cumin seeds, they had the texture of potato chips and came with mint cilantro chutney and tamarind chutney. The tamarind chutney was sweet and mysterious, while the mint and cilantro was a wide open book, peppery hot and shouting cilantro. Crisp, tightly wrapped, deep-fried triangle samosas were chinched almost to bursting with spicy ground beef. It seemed as if each tasty, roundish morsel of beef couldn't wait to escape confinement and tumble into my mouth. Moguls were the best savory samosas I've ever had. Mogul's tandoori chicken was dark meat chicken on the bone blackened at the edges and covered in slick brown globules of spicy yogurt marinade and seasoning. Think of the last time you had an exceptional feed of barbecued chicken and you might be close to how Mogul's tandoori chicken tasted. The same chutneys were served and the sweet tamarind absolutely ruled in combination with the smoky bird. Mogul offers six different kinds of naan bread, from regular to kima naan, a naan stuffed with minced beef. We tried the rogni naan, a fluffy variety, puffy, soft, and buttery. It was more fun to eat than plain naan, in the same way a fluffy omelette is more appealing occasionally than a shallow omelette. Classic, rich, butter chicken with basmati rice was the most luxurious dish. A thick golden sauce of spiced yogurt, onions, garlic, tomato, and nut paste did an effective job of visually camouflaging chunks of boneless chicken. But not the chicken's flavor. Spicing was subtle enough for the taste of the chicken to find its way to the front. Sauce with chicken over basmati rice couldn't have been better. Before leaving, we tried the deep-fried chickpea-battered tilapia, a mild-tasting whitefish. It was fresh, crispy, and beautifully cooked. Here, I thought the peppery mint cilantro chutney made the best match. It was a pleasant accent, and certainly very different from bottle tartar sauce. Mogul Restaurant receives a rating of three out of four stars. Dinner for two with tax and tip costs approximately $65. For reservations, call 781-1099.